covered out the nose! Alright, let's uh, death knight it up. Nothing shall prevent me from having my revenge. 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 Um, Keymaster, I think, is fine. Let's have some fun with it. Red and green, Fistful? You don't usually want to go red and green, but uh, I kind of don't want these cards, right? Frozen Over is like double thrust, isn't it? You just don't understand. It's not really that hard. It's anonymous. Playing it is just like any other class. It's drafting it that's a little different. Thank you, Bray. Yeah, Steve, this one's called Firestone. I don't think I take Champion. We could just go Rainbow. I'm going Fistful. This guy is just too much better than this, I think. Double blood? Yo, double blood is different to usual though, right? You don't get double blood that often. Dude, double blood? Would you say Murloc Holmes 4 cost cheaper is better than Alabaster's effect? It depends, right? It's hard to say. Nah, it sucks. I mean, it depends what you get offered. But, uh, am I actually taking Bunny to remain Rainbow? Like, isn't that worse? I, I, I know double blood can be bad, but you can never get a good double blood if you don't try. And if we lose, we fit in another run. Easy. Line dance. I think I might take a swarm guide. Hematage is in, yeah. Hematage is in. Line dance. Hematage. Watcher. Could actually take a blood worm with the swarm guide. Could also take the three. I think I just go with the two. Um. I think I actually go Runes of Darkness. I'm not getting the Frost Excavates, right? So I think I go Runes. Blood Guide. Wandmaker is very good though, right? I would say normally Geo is maybe fine, but I'm not Frost, so maybe it's harder. Acceptable 2, Acceptable 3. Double Blood and Unholy does need draw, so maybe I do go well bonkies. It's not like Sneaky Scout's game winning. There's draw and I'll take it. Soul Cage could be interesting. I don't want AMS. I think we just go drone. Swarm again? Maybe try to hit Blood Boy or something like that. Bunker is sometimes better, but let's go for Mining Casualties. Drone again. Possessy. Or do I need the high roll four? Maybe I need the high roll four. Nah, Possessy's good. Possessy twice. You ever take Brew? Actually. Maybe I just take Brew. I could brew line dances, I could brew wand maker, I could brew hematage or swarm guard. Maybe I do take a brew. I have some interesting brew hits. Let's try a brew. Sunspot. Dark transformation. I'm not going for this. Runes again. Unholy Frenzy for some scam potential. Wanna blit? Hima? Second Unholy? 
swarm again. And a henchman. Looks interesting. Oh, let's play. All right, that's a lot better. The line dances are a bit stranded. They activate each other though, and I do have Baron and Web Bunker. Can I generate three costs? Weapons from runes. They are a little stranded. I think you should be keeping Hematurge, even if I don't activate it earlier. Something like this. Let's pour this coffee. Alright, we can watch on too. He must can help. I still think I should be holding this. Don't keep your thoughts to yourself. Well then. Benedictus is quite rare, I would say. So I think I won the buff. No light bugs, no heal, no okay. bomb, no Nova and stuff. Oh, damn. Am I still swarm guarding? I want to swarm guard into brew, but I think I have to kill the frothing. So double trade frothing swarm? It's a little awkward though. But what else can I do? Double oh, trade hematurge. No, they have to be shadow. They have to be shadow. Swarm goodbye, double trade into the frothing, right? Hey, it's still a little awkward. I don't like going phased. If I go phased, the 3 2 trades. Oh, you just kill the 3 2, maybe? I could. But then they have what? They end up with a 4 4, and they trade here, and then they ping my 2 2, and how do I kill their other half, right? I don't know then, you know. Almost tempted to hero power. Double trade, hero power, brew, runes. Not even. Is this hero power even worth it? Maybe. I think this happens, this happens. The question is what I do from here. Thing I want a blood boil. I don't even know if I want more weapons though. Maybe it is just more and poor. Double blood boil is interesting, but I have a light bar and I have a drafted blood boil. I'm quite up in health. I'm kind of feeling safe. Right now, right? This is a big swing as well. Good blood guy. Could go like um, vicious into swarm guard now, for example. I have plays into AoE a little bit though, unfortunately. I could might have metal and swing and just play wand maker. I think that's actually fine. 
Actually, I could play henchman now, huh? I'll make sure you suffer. Okay. So, I don't even know what they have. A card from my deck, a forged card. There's death. Yeah, weapons can smart, for sure. Let the priest win. When I play priest, people don't let me win, though. I don't want. I think I. I full trade. I'll make sure you suffer. Can we do something like this? Try play the tier. Thank you. So we have Swarm Guard Monpo, for example, but yeah, I think I Swarm Guard and now I start smarking. Ooh. Then again. My certainty is gone. Great harvest, eh? No, we're too far off from lethal. I think I'm holding back the swing. Yeah, I could push seven face, play more unholy frenzy kind of thing, right? Uh, is there lethal potential now though? Did I play? I played Bloodguard first, right? Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Lethal. Eye for Hey Fuzzy! 11 months and you just get the sub? Thank you so much. Oh, there we go. Grace was perfectly calculated. Thank you Fuzzy for the 11 months. It's like a baby and a half right there. Thank you so very much, Fuzzy. How you doing? You will know endless torment. I feel like this might be a keep. Uh, five rogue, ten shaman today. Just someone just did it right before you. Caparation is why it didn't come up. Almost a cake. Wait, what do you mean almost a cake? Twelve months is a cake, huh? Twelve months is a what now? Oh, birthday, oh, just laser, <laughs> mate. <laughs> Honestly, watching Arena play is kind of soothing after beating your brains uh, out on ladder for the last three weeks. Just vibe away, Tony. See if we find something for this. Hmm. You ever take blood tap instead of patchwork, guys? Yeah, right. I might though do like a loot hoarder heart strike. We'll see. If they play something like an heart strike blood tap, I might. Cobalt gonna jump into some arenas, huh? So do I just loot her there here? I think I do. Hmm. 
man, it feels so bad though. The vision not guide me. Not sure there, but I prefer this to playing line dance. I think I prefer this to playing vicious. I think I prefer to playing a three three henchman as well. I like to think they teach me. Might hero power blood tap even here? Let's see what we draw. Okay. My blood for the Lich King. Another one. Or Sour Fang now. Like Monpa so much. It does give me five corpses, but might might honestly just be blood death. Time is against me. Play one now. I think I'm gonna greed though. I think I'm gonna greed. I'm gonna play like a, a weird bloody blood control kind of thing. You think Maul over Sarfang? Of blood tap into swarm, maybe. Right. I also have this. I have. I. I can. <laughs> what if I blood worm hit the swarm guard though? I'm undead. Mm, that's actually a little annoying. Cause now I don't really want to go wide, right? Hmm. So now what? I guess I still play the swarm, right? It's just such a strong play, right? If I can, like, uh, trade Keymaster, for example... Enter the freaking Colisium! Mate! Yo, mate! Alright, what about now? Am I still key mastering? Because I can possess the end hero power and end up with a 7 4. Nah. That's when I used to play Constructed, that's exactly what I used to do as I go like. Eight years ago, dust every golden card to to try and actually make playable decks. That's my bag. Well, I used to. I was a constructed player, free to play. I, I I don't even have full sets, but I used to try to create one-offs here and there. So possess a hero power here. Hey Valia. I end up with a 7-4, which kinda sucks. But what else am I doing? Just throwing everything into this. This card is kicking me. My certainty is gone. Tank three, put down the hench. Maybe, huh? I can be very persuasive. 
a little scared, not gonna lie. Enter the Coliseum Double Assassinate. Um, is pretty strong versus me deciding to go with a double blood tap. You don't usually expect Rogue to do something like that, right? But it happens. No, when I used to play Constructed, now I only dust nerf cards. Now I don't even care about Constructed, right? It's Rogue. I don't expect double draft to assassinate in their first uh, uh, seven cards. Sunspot lethal? Kind of ruins my line dance, but if I hit Sunspot, it's lethal, right? The Citadel stands strong. I have to trade now. I think I have to trade both ways, even. I mean... Another arena reward laurel post on readies, comment section is pure salt. Give me, give me TLDR. Well, yeah, but don't you think it's safer to trade there? Like, sincerely. Because I'm so likely to oh, still set up lethal. 7, 10... Seven, ten, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighty-nine, twenty, twenty-one. Surely, right? Yeah, yeah. You go for the tosser. Surely, it's not guaranteed, though, guys. But surely, right? Wait, do I have the space? Oh! Good catch. I think the gem tosser would have still gotten us there, but... Good, good call, chat. Good call, chat. Chat, leave it. That is true. I didn't think about that, actually. I'll be honest. Hey, Rafa. Had excavate, too. That's true. There were a lot of outs. Probably key, please. Nah, I mean, the truth is, I go that... <laughs> the devs don't really listen to Reddit necessarily, because a lot of it is uh, people over-complaining. I, uh, I actually have had people come in here as I go and complain that a 12 win does not give you 50 packs and 2,000 gold and it's ridiculous that you get anything less. 
So when when complaints include complaints like that, Trust no one. Not even me. I mean, what? <laughs> like what? They should do that actually. Sure. It was it was not the last heroic brawl, the one before, where someone came in and told me Arena should give you more rewards on heroic brawl because it's hard there since you don't build your own deck. Despite, it, and it doesn't matter that the entry cost is 10%. Yeah. I think I go for a weapon. Staff, these are too expensive. I agree it might be harder, Zygo, but uh, giving more rewards for 10% of the cost seems weird. I'm a noob and I got a 9 or 10 when rank only 160 gold. Oh, uh, BX, I'm not saying the rewards are amazing, they really should be reworked. I think the amount they give on average is well designed in a way. Like, they don't want everyone to be getting infinite gold if you average 2. You know what I mean? But they should, re should really, really not be that variant, right? If you go 9, you shouldn't be able to lower all 160 gold. Right, BX? Just make it more consistently 250 gold. You know what I mean? I think that will make people feel better. It removes some of the high rolls, but it removes all the bad feelings of the low rolls. Oh yeah, one comment said 12 wins should always give 500 plus. Like, that's... 500 is like super rare high roll. Every 12 in arena run should give you one Bobby Coltix Yachts. Uh, I already have them all, Coast. You want a, a heroic arena? That could be a cool idea. I think you should remove. I think they should remove um, dust and non-golden cards from arena rewards. The minimum for 12 wins is 240 gold, a pack, a golden common, and a golden rare. Is this a good blood tap? Probably. Do I do it now is the question. I think I do. Thing is they're gonna get the kill back, right though, which kinda of, I was gonna loot. Maybe I still loot harder. I don't know. Will the vision time is against me? I'll do this just in case. If they find another way of killing this, I can swarm stuff to kill it. What about the packs? What's the point of getting a pack of rewards in an arena player? Well, uh, not every not every arena player. Free Boy is a pure arena player. Do you know what I mean? A lot of people play arena in order to have a fun way of converting it into packs. Um, so there's that as well. Or well, you could choose your entry fee and scale rewards based off of that. Yeah, it does, that, those things could be kind of cool, right? Sure Would be fun if 12 wins had a distinct premium. And 12 one 12 should give extra. I think they should remove dust. I think they should even out the gold variance. I think they should remove non-golden cards, and I think 12s should have something, like... In the same way you can get legendaries and golden legendaries, maybe signature, even though it's rare. You know, just throw it in there. Did they ram? Or even, like, special arena things. Portraits or something, that would be cool. That's, like, an aside from the rewards, though, I think. I think that would be cool, too. I think scaling down, or, or rather moving the rewards down a win is also more fair now that averages are way harder to maintain, like making infinite 6 for example. 
Yeah, maybe they should add titles, right? So I go like Dose of Coffee, Giga Chad of Arena, winner of all games. I think I go for this with a hero power, right? Eh? Just I just want I wanna pressure them. No, achievements give you nothing, can he? If there ever arena only achievement porches, I bet my leftover soul they would split them into achievable fragments. The hell does that even mean? Didn't they give a Death Knight portrait for 12 in the Brolyseum? They did. It was the Crimson Psy. I They gave one for the 3 as well. I got it, the Frost Psy. In Mercs, you get fragments of heroes. I mean, you think they're gonna create fragments for portraits? Draft seems kinda dirty. Is this a DK? Guy rolling DKs? Ooh, no, Shaman. Shock Hopper, double conductivity with Amphibious, a Note Taker, double Nimbus, Sleet. So that's your Frosty. Shroomscavate, Finley, double digging and a Wild Paw. Holy book, mate. Mate. This was undead for a second. Surely it's lethal. My certainty is gone. Very persuasive. Very much. This can summon taunts, right? It's not an undead. I just checked. It's an elemental, guys. There's my title! There it is! The appropriate title! Artus versus Illidan! Today, Today, what? Brian! Brian, get your words right, Brian! What's a Dragon Mate, Brian! I appreciate the effort, Brian, but man, I'm gonna fire you, Brian. But that has nothing to do with the lovely donator, HS Arena. Cheers, HS Arena. Thank you for, uh, thank you for that. Well, DK runes are best for Arena. I would normally say you probably want to have uh, two Frost in there. One Frost at least or something, maybe. Wow, that's... That's lagging right there. Can I call you country boy, though, Bray? Hey, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Enslin. Can I be honest with you? Hey, I have it so that the text-to-speech shouldn't read out the gifted subs, right? And I have every single possible variant set up to not read gifted subs, as in, it would read the text-to-speech and the messages, but not the Hey Dobre gifted ATR1 sub 2, right? Me? For some reason, it still reads individually gifted subs, irrespectively. What do you mean 
fire, man. For now, I was trying to cut just fine. Yeah, sure you do, Brian. Sure you do, Brian. Sure, sure you do. Hey, thank you for the cheer, Major. Test. So, okay, okay, wait, I need to figure something out here. First of all, Robo, thank you so very much for the gifted sub to Xenodors. My certainty is gone. Secondly, did you target someone in particular, Robopop? Or did you target someone in particular, hey, and not vice versa? Maybe there's some loophole in my alerts I have to figure out. I'll take the free hit here. All right, Bray. Go for that run. Lurk away, man. And good luck with your shaman, man. Looks dope. Random. All right, so I have them all set up, supposedly. Even targeted should not read it out, but maybe I need to, like, put, like, three variations on the targeting and figure something out from there. Oh no, he's he's just testing. That actually read it though, right? The second one was Giga Chad, right? It was actually right. Thank you, thank you guys for all the support. Hey Dobre, thank you for the 100 biddies. Lassafin. <laughs> thank you so much for the donation, Lassafin. Cheers. This one, the scuffy is for you. I mean, it's for me technically, but for you? From you? For me? Yeah, the alerts are uh, not, not working well, huh? They are lagging like F. Why? Why are they lagging? Falcon man! Moving the hype? More like good luck, Falcon. Boy oh boy, good luck, Falcon. I'll make sure you suffer. It's uh... Hopefully the start of a new amazing journey, Falcon. I'm moving out of the hotel, huh? Thank you for the uh, 7 million gifted subs, Falcon. Just so much support. Thank you. Thank you so much. I, I sincerely wish you the best with your move. I, I, I assume you've planned it quite well now, since, you know, you've been in the hotel and you've been thinking about it for a while, but I, I hope it goes smoothly nonetheless. I've never made a coffee on stream now. I mean, you can believe I drink tea for all I care. Yeah, I don't have a weapon in my deck, by the way, to whoever asked uh, Slim Shady. Are you okay with no muncher being roomless in less than a month? Well, the idea of it, right, Mark, is constructed for whatever that's worth. 
So, I mean, it's gonna be a little too strong, maybe. Death Knight is going to really take a ramp up. Their idea is to open more archetypes for it in Constructed, right? Make cards that aren't restricted to certain archetypes, but uh, gonna, gonna be a little tough, I think. There he is, the legend. Thanks those have out today, but keep me hold everyone till the weekend. Just to make sure with the move. Yeah, I always used to, uh, when I rented places, Falcon, I always used to have one to two days overlap. So, uh, so I can, uh, like, actually move and stuff and go back and sleep in the original place and things. So I, I can kind of imagine. Uh, thank you, though, Falcon. The support is huge. And I wish you the best. Honestly, this might be a key. I can't like watch a full match on, on stream, pill guy. Nero? Yeah, sure, wait, I can have a I can have a quick scroll through. Let's see what we get from this. I think I actually coin reborn. Is that weird? It's a little bit, but I think I do it. Divine Shield and Reborn I would go for, let's see. Mm, they do get the Tentacle, which kind of ruins it all though, but it's all right. Did you see 17 double in esports group for a BG's tournament? No, that's awesome. I know he's doing a lot of work for, uh... I know he's doing a lot of work for Arena, and I'm hoping he gets some cool Arena things going as well. Wow, they had the Elemental from the past. The Surly Mob. Um... Yeah, let's go Line Dance right now, see what we get. Probably take this trade. Okay, take the trade. But no, I did not see. What are you gonna do? You... Willow? Summons the fight. Oh my god, monstrous form. Dude, that opponent is surviving, but you're doing some stuff here. I think I'll go... I think I might take this trade, actually. Play around Hellfire a little bit. That ten did ether though. 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 <laughs> nice one, guy. Alright, let's do this and brew it. Let them take a few trades, I don't really care. I think I'll play well bonker because I can kill off all the one ones. Mahuto with the hydrate, sure. Guys! Thank you for the huge support there. That is a cute emote, actually. The ghost. Thank you to uh, Anonymous slash Hearthstone Arena. Who came in with a big donation, kicked off the hype train. Then Hey, who had the gifted, Major with the cheer, Robo with the gifted, Hey with the cheer, Lassifin who came in with the donation, Falcon with the big gifted sub bomb there to end it off. Thank you guys and gals. Uh, Senf Kiki, thank you for the follow, Senf. Yeah, I was way ahead though, right, Hango? And I also had the 4 mana uh, 915 coming in next turn. Who, uh, who knows who Quagmire is? Giggly! I can't do it. 
Giggity. I haven't seen Family Guy in like six years now. Does, does that even still exist? Does it still come out? Giggity. Who else but Quagmire? <laughs> giggity, giggity. <laughs> giggity, giggity, goo. Watcher here. It was so windy. Let's wash her first, because I could get an expensive spell like Hand of a Doll, so it might change my next turn. We could bless this into a 5-5. Five five. Why not? That actually, actually kind of worked! My blood for the Lich King. I think I might take a patchwork here and just play the one. Thank you for the cheer, mate. <laughs> Is it true there is a problem in the arena with Varko decks? I've been recently noticing myself in the EU. Well, there is a, a little bit of a problem, but it's been going on for more than a year, Resurrect. So, I mean, it's been going on for many years. Just kind of been brought a little bit more to light. I guess you can say more recently. Damn, I need to stop getting rune foraging though. Okay. I know this may seem weird, but I think I want to do this. American Dad's so much better. So I used to watch Family Guy, I don't know until when, Blackout Chili, and then I got bored of it when it felt like it became repetitive. It was more like my chill just leave something to, to watch on the side or whatever kind of thing. And I swapped to American now I got bored of that as well. I haven't watched them both for many years now though, I would say. Bonebreaker or Menethil? I don't want the cheap thing, but maybe Menethil helps me pull into a Blood Boil turn. It's a little expensive for an next turn. I could Bone Breaker now and play the Spark Bot, but it just feels weird. So I think I take Menethil and just do something slow like this. Get the corpses. Menethil next turn plus Henchman, right? And then Blood Boil. Hey, John! How you doing, MTG expert? Hey, Oakman as well. Could you repeat that? Mm, how am I killing this now? Yeah, first morning feels a little bit too slow, especially when my hand is already full of stuff at this point. Okay, just don't freeze the 3-5. The thing is they're gonna they're gonna get the double spell. Do I ever obliterate left? No, right. I feel like they're gonna digging straight down. Oh, if I do obliterate and go for the weapon. Depends if I do something else was then my thinking, right? But you ever blood worm instead here? Nah, I think I just give it to him. I gotta kill this. The question is, do I blood boil these two? Probably patchwork is fine, right? Oh. Okay. Try and get some heal going though now. I kind of want them to like, I don't know, play totally awesome totems or whatever they are. 
Rag sniped. So Rag in hand, Night Captain in deck is what it got. Yeah, yeah, play a one drop, a totem, awesome totems. Let's go. Trade all even better. Oh no, my favorite combo. Oh no, guys, it's my favorite combo. I want to blood boil this poopy board. I think I just swing and take the damage straight up. With every strike, we will strike back harder. I'll make sure you suffer. This lethal. Penflinger and Elixir. Now it's Elixir into Lightning Reflexes, into Full Clear, into Elixir, into Lightning Reflexes, into Full Clear, into Elixir, into Lightning Reflexes. Yeah, the idea was that I would get a buff on a mech, be it this or this, right? Which would then translate into Wind Fury. I did draft Blood Boil. You haven't had it offered in ages. You do have to have double blood as an option, Marlboro, which is why most people don't go for it, right? Do I? Do I? I don't even want to go spark, but with this, right? Because they're just gonna double. They're just gonna double pen finger it. Yeah, easy alabaster and what? Is blood DK strong? I think it's probably one of the worst runes, but that doesn't mean you can't draft a good deck with it, right? Even Demon Hunter can have a good deck kind of thing, and I, I would say their blood death knight's better than Demon Hunter. I could fist for this. I feel like I keep it. I could bless just for the kill. Hmm. Time is against me. Open yourself up. I think I'm just gonna do this. Sets up a potential blood boy. Okay. I mean, I still got it, Theo. What you laugh? I still got it, brother. <sighs> hey, loser. <laughs> Opponent drafted nothing but elementals, really? Oh, damn. Hey, happy Monday, Shippy! Thank you for the good luck, man. Fistful. Let's see what's in this first. this next turn for no overload, right? Maybe I just take it nice and slow and easy here. And it'll boop. It seems to be ahead here, so we'll just hold. I just think the best World of Legends is a pop guy and Jack is I'm now starting to think Willow's a top contender. No, I don't think so at all. I've drafted many Warlocks with none of those demons. So you could have a dead legendary also, right? Basically. Yeah, they have almost only played uh, 
Rag was from Nimbus, to be fair, Hango. Do I even bother minecart cruiser here, guys? I don't think I even bother, right? Just hero power this and play loot harder. My certainty is gone. Do it something like this. Base? Why not here? I think here. In case of a healing totem. I guess I could always do it next turn. But I don't really care about the one damage. Just also stops like this. It dies anyway. Yeah, but... I don't know. Healing totem. It should die. And they're probably going to kill it off with a trade. But I don't think I care about the one damage base. When did the arena leaderboard reset? Oh, like a month ago, I think. Pill guy, I would say. Four and a half weeks, maybe. Something like that. I kind of want them to go all in on this and now I obliterate it. No, it was more like, I think it was like 17th January, something like that, pill guy. Okay. 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 Six point seven one average. I mean, what can I say? Yeah, you know, I was at, at a bit above seven, like four times already. This meta. <laughs> you have to remember, I play probably the most from the the streamers. I think I've played more than a hundred runs. It's like my average of a hundred runs, not forty or fifty or whatever. Chaman messed up the order. That's true, Eric. How the order actually makes a difference there, right? Mafundi has played a lot as well. Mafundi has been playing quite a lot as well, huh? Sometimes people aren't aware of that one, Erikald. Alright, not the henchman, basically, please. Awesome. I'm just kicking. We're here for some high quality games and some kick W's. I think I just uh, play the well bunker, kill this up. Ah! <laughs> What do I owe the pleasure? We have a Natty raid! Hello, Natty. Not Nate, Natty. Get a shout out to Natty. We raided her last time, guys. You want some uh, fun BG content? A nice little bit of uh, community game sometimes as well. Check out Natty's stream. Welcome. How was your stream, Natty? Did you have some fun today? Hello, welcome, Jason. Jave Javi, welcome. Daniel, Eminence. Did you beat Eminence today in BG's, Natty? Or did Eminence win? As as should be the case. Let's go for the double draw here. <laughs> I could line on Schematage. I think if they had the AoE, they would have potentially just done it, right? So, let's go for it. 
Uh, I'll go weapon. I know I have another weapon, but the freeze heal is great. Rober, thank you very much for the follow. She always beats you, Eminence. I put my trust in you, Eminence. <laughs> I'm picking. Hope you all had some fun. Um, welcome, everyone. We are playing a little bit of arena here. May not be your jam, may be your jam. Jam. It's lovely to have you. I want to kill this. I could just Quartzite. I could also start smacking face with the Quartzite. I feel like they're going to try and AoE me. That being said, they didn't have a 5 mana or a 3 mana AoE. And they just coin, so they can't really tumbleweed. So I think I just do this and go for the weapon. I think I just send it face. Yeah, 21 isn't aware. I'm Dose of Coffee. I play myself some arena. Uh, we hang, we chill, we chat. And I support Eminence when they're in BGs. So, uh, welcome. Good to have you. Hello, Robert. Arena's everyone's jam? No, it's not everyone's jam. Which is fine. Had you at coffee? Perfect. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I could... I can't really find lethal. Maybe I can from Watcher of the Sun. Let's see what Watcher gives me. And that is not lethal. I think it's time to swap for a little draw then. Hmm. What's going on here? Big chunky weapon? Heal weapon. Let's go big chunky weapon. This guy can just end the game. Honestly. And let's go for some extra draw here. A little bit of this. A little bit of this. A little bit of this. Get a little draw going. Ooh, just short. We'll drop the seven. We'll just push face. I won't forget how your viewer joined one game after you raided me. That was Turtle Cube. I didn't even really know he plays BGs, Natty. <laughs> Eminence. You didn't have to, my friend, but I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for coming in with a new sub there, Eminence. Enjoy a uh, little coffee mug, a little coffee emotes, and uh, my continued support. <laughs> Ah, uh, this deals more damage, right? Is why. Evanovich. Does it just not? Always lethal. Always lethal. Always lethal. What did I summon first? This was last. Oh, I'm gonna believe. Maybe he doesn't. I think Title Keep does play a little bit. I just don't really talk about BGs here, Natty, so I wasn't aware, to be honest with you. Thanks for believing in me and BGs, but Coffee, you figured the wrong guy. Nah, in the end, I was joking around Eminence. Um, it looked like you were having fun, that's the most important thing. I'm glad you had a good stream as well, Natty. We discovered first, I think Ashbringer was lethal. I don't think it was Eames because I couldn't deal the three from my weapon, so it was only plus three damage, basically. But you don't need more damage in that spot really ever. It's just above they do something crazy to come back and heal. The Ashbringer is just always better in that case. Man, Line Lance is really good. I'm gonna risk it. I don't know. I'm double blood. I have blood boil, right? I, I feel like I have the heal to support it. I don't know though. Maybe Ivanovich. Ooh, yeah, we're coining threes. Let's go. Double blood's supposed to be crap. 
You forget though, Seb. You know who's playing though, Seb? You know who's playing though, Seb? I woke up this morning in Natty's stream. I think I was raided there and never got sent anywhere else. Or someone has tagged Natty with a raid last night. I raided Natty longer, not yesterday though. But she is a really nice gal. Oh, Redbeard today. Redbeard's a legend as well. Alright, we'll just go another line dance here and just keep pushing face, right? Ooh. Does my opponent have henchmen? Or do I do? Oh, I have henchmen. I don't know if another edge. The henchman's only as good as the master, right? Redbeard. Save? Save maybe raids Redbeard? Does save stream late enough to hit red? Ooh, they feel pressured. Oh, they feel pressured. Oh, they feel pressured. Um, you ever double trade and play the swarm guide here? One trade and play the swarm guide? Or just double two? Value trade three dome. Ain't no way what? I play the swarm guide. Uh, guide me. I do it this way. I don't know. I, I've never, I've never, I've literally never seen the end of a uh, of a save stream. I got a follow earlier with the you had me at coffee, Dado Cuties. I'm sorry I missed that, but thank you very much for the follow. You know, I don't think I've I don't think I've ever been offered ET Boy from Glacier and Saigo. For whatever that's worth. Do I even bother brewing this? I feel like I don't. Because I can always do it with this. So I do like a uh, henchman wand maker. Tear. I could also hematurge maybe instead of wand. One should give me a playable one, I believe. No, he's still in there though. Okay, there are there are there are more than just the rune forging hits, right, guys? It wasn't removed, Saigo. It's just not oh, that unlucky. Me. Right, it's, it wasn't removed. It's just the pool is quite large. I don't know how many glaciates you've been playing, but I don't think the pool is that large. Uh, sorry, I think the pool is quite large. I've seen him though. I discovered him today from something. Not glaciate though, but I don't know. Something. I could do a double hematurge hero power line now into Alabaster. Ooh. Double runes in the deck, but the oh, it was mismatched. Mm -mm. Mm. Just a by chance thing, I think. As I go,
Another win in the bag. Just cruising here, cruising on. Double blood, more like those giga chat. I don't know why I keep saying this. I think I gone, I've gone crazy today. Twenty ones, maybe a little new here or something. I, uh, I feel like I've gone a little crazy today. I'm not gonna lie. What's MVP in this deck? New coffee? No, I didn't change my coffee like a lammer. That, that smiley though, Lana. I must protect the wild. You will know endless torment. Kuro sleeping, don't wake her. Is she exhausted from uh, country life? Country life. Country life. Country life. Yeah. I hope you both had a, a restful break though, rather than just, uh, I don't know, property window shopping. I think I almost want to keep this. Better twos. Line Niles. Line Niles is pretty good. It's also inconsistent in this deck, huh? I'm actually keeping it. It's weird, but... Yeah, Line Niles is great, but I've had it in positions where it wasn't good as well, huh? I'm not sure. Keeping Loot Horror might not be the correct line. Never mind, I finally got him, wow. Hey, I'm new to the game, does anyone know any good YouTuber for the game? Well, it depends what mode you're looking for, I would say. <laughs> Thank you, Kami and Andre. How sweet of you. Uh, is it weird that I, I don't want a Baron here? They're just gonna value trade, but I guess it lets me swarm guard. The best line would have been Hematurgen to Heartstrike, but that's not that likely, right? Uh, there's a, there's a, a lot of really good content creators illegal. I mean, I create content on YouTube as well, but... The will of the Forsaken is unbreakable. Hmm. Hematurge... I think I swarm, but we start with this. I feel like I'm falling very much behind here, guys. I might have to do like a Hematurge Dark Transformation trade next turn, we'll see. Okay. Are they pre-trading? They don't pre-trade, there's runes. I think I have to Hematurge. And we'll see what else to do. Fistful of corpses, or do I need a heal? Might need fistful. Although I could just play Noxious right now to kill this, and then also play the henchman. That's quite interesting, right? It's actually a really tough one here. My certainty is gone. I think I'm actually going noxious, honestly. I guess I could just fistful straight up right now. But I think I'm doing this. Maybe weird. Just lets me do this. I could get the tempo swing later. I could get it right now. If they really want to hero power the 1-1 one, one and trade here, that's fine. I have a 4-1. The idea is that I get a brew on this, hopefully. Perfect. Oh. Ready for another round. 
well executed, man. You gotta give me that, huh? I have both players, Kazakusan going on at 7-2. Ooh! Damn, Brownie, what the what class is? Oh, that's their double. That's actually pretty good. I'm gonna have to fistful this. There's some heal. So I could fistful rune and bloodguard trade off the two too. maybe started. I think I take the heal. I'll trade this up and just push this. And that's a turnaround right there! That's a turnaround right there. I'm expecting race Raza soon, maybe. Okay. So am I trading into this? So close to lethal, right? 6, 10, 13. I don't think I even bother. Rage, Smark. The issue with Smark is they're gonna play four one ones with Taunt, right? I have to trade then. I miss. He plays Swarm Guide for the 1-1s. One mm. Then depends what else they do, right? Like, this feels quite clean right now. Priest and Paladin, his from Time Loss and yours from Grace. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you meant you're, they were both drafted, Win Brownie. Yeah, if they play Rhea here, they're dead, right? That's... The thing is, if I go face Elmo, they're gonna trade this 2 2 and play 4 1 1s, maybe. Ah, yeah, they're going for the taunt. Yeah, the 4 7 buffs them, but. Okay. 1 2 3, 1 2 3, 6 10, 11. How's your eyes, Mafundi? Oh, they don't play the taunt. Okay. to remove your eyes. Oh my. Against Druid! Nah, we're, we're close to lethal, right? I'll, I'll just do this, it's fine. Mofandi well, got pepper in his eyes, I think he said. Oh, try resurrect ghoul for lethal. I could have done something like that, Black Forest. I didn't feel like I need to go for it, though. Right, and the, the play would be so bad if I whiff. Right, I need to rush to the bathroom, guys. Uh, but we're going for the double Ds. Double D-O. Double D-O. Let's go.
All right. What is even going on? You wanna blow something up? <laughs> oh, that's incredible. Heart strike. Dude, if this gives me soul forging again. None can falter. Guess I could hematurge instead. Hmm. My blood for the Lich King. Ooh. Yeah, I think you take Noxious. The tempo is just so good. Alright, Rodan. Ooh, got a follow there as I ran to the bathroom earlier. Sar, thank you for the follow, Sar. They're gonna try and hit me with AoE here, but what do I do? AoE incoming. I mean, I could split and go trade and play the one and the two instead. So let's see what this gives us. Dude, are there are there other? Can someone please tell me? Has one maker given me rune forging like every time, but like once or something? There's at least runes of darkness and fistful in the pool. What the hell are the odds? Yeah, yeah there's at least this card in the pool, right? <laughs> Can I not give you? I don't even know anymore, Trangs. Uh, yeah, if you're if you're watching this on YouTube, let me know in the comment section down below why my one maker is glitched. Bolster doesn't work on the high jump poster if it turns into taunt. What's bolster again? What's bolster again? I think I need to do this. It's kind of a last push. You plus two plus two to your taunt minions. In play. Oh, nice try, Phil guy. No, we don't have a weapon in the deck. That's my issue. Psych. Otherwise, it would be playable. <laughs> Otherwise, it would be playable. Hope you don't have two left feet. I don't think I gift of luminance. I think I just hero power. If I can somehow gift the key master ass blaster. Yeah, if this can stick one turn, I doubt it though. My opponents have cards like this. A clear guard. Just full trade, Alabaster, right? Alabaster was the name of the evolved form of Grabbo- There's something weird about- What? Again? <laughs> I swear, what? Again? <laughs> of course, and they have the random clear. Why not? Alright, we're fine. Um, the evolved form of Graboids in the Tremors series. even want to gift of luminance now this I guess I feel like I'm gonna lose this one now am I taking? Freezing their minions is interesting. 
think it's still the quartz site though. Successfully drafted a Benedictus deck, now to win a game with it, when my apply faced Benedictus deck actually, in this run. Top deck what? Jade? Okay. I don't know why I didn't want to do it before. Why isn't another 3 5 good for me, Ivanovich? What do you mean? Hero power worth it here? There's another Reddit post of someone trying Benedictus and failed at pick 26, and then people noticed there was a tram heist in the day. Some people think it's just not holy rather than. You can't even have no spell school ones. No, I have so many health, right, Ivanovich? And this is healing me for 16. Okay, I'm going for a cycle. Yeah, yeah, it's passing on no spell school that hurts the most, I think. AoE. Jordan comes in pairs, Mufundi, right? I draft it twice, I miss lethal twice, it draws two cards, it gives you two attack. So it's like the balls of Michael, you know? And, uh... Well, uh... <laughs> people, uh... Well, 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 people, uh, screenshot it, what can I say? I was explaining how, what, because I called it the balls of Michael after a joke, okay? And, uh, like, two days later, okay, two days later, I, as, as a joke to people who were there two days early, I said balls of Michael. And everyone's like, what do you mean balls of Michael? That doesn't make sense. So I explained it, and as I'm explaining it, people take a screenshot, and here we are. <laughs> Uh, and here we are. And now, now, now I have a command, so... <laughs> Michael is a lucky man. I don't know, Mafandi. Pairs, because it says stones, it's like draw two, deal to attack, I miss lethal twice or whatever. Have, uh, funny. The best explanation I can give you is Twitch chat, okay? <laughs> like, like, I don't know what to say, man. <laughs> hey, Shadow Dragon. You are not my king yet, boy. You are not my king yet, boy. I keep Hema. Do you ever keep Blood Boy? Nah. 
This guy's got too many Ds for me. That's okay, okay. I think we just go Hima though now. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're setting up, we're setting up, we're setting up. Ooh. Yeah, I think it's Blood Boil, right? It's a tough call, though. They all have their merits. Wait, what was the first one? I don't even know what the first one was, can I be honest with you? <laughs> it was Fistful or Blood Boil. More? I don't want more. I don't want more. I think we risk this. Just hope one of them survives. So I can brew it. I could, if they don't trade here, I might even just blood boil. That's smart. They now get double of a holy, right? They are going for the trade. Okay. So am I taking a bad line here now? Like a slow turn for a strong next turn? I think I do. The question is, do I play Baron? Gotta be the Baron, right? The Citadel stands strong. Yeah, that's that's the reason I was thinking about not playing Baron, by the way, but whatever. Ma isn't a fine, but could be better. Uh drop psych. What about now though? Surely I just play the three fives, right? Vicious first and then the three fives. Is gone. I'm scared because they have two holy spells, right? Frenzy turn! I don't have frenzy, right? <sighs> so close. Let's try something like this. Ah, that's what I was worried about. Damn. I knew Prismatic wasn't holy, but that's what I was worried about, right? Prismatic cons. So we know they have another cons now. I think I just play this anyway, right? I don't know. Getting a 2 mana 7-7 seven, seven out here is pretty sweet, though. I think we do this. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Like, I want to play it, but... Okay. This is just stealth. Oh, stealth and rush. Oh, interesting move from them, huh? I need to kill this thing. How am I killing this, guys? Kind of scared here. Weapon? Find the freeze weapon? Will the vision I could transform the Kaleidosaur. Four, five, six, seven. Very persuasive. 
With the poison on board, I'm going for the kill here. I'll get this out next turn. I'll go Ash here. Trans... Rock Taunt? Hero power transformation instead of this. I could actually, right? You gotta keep a 4 1 instead of this. That's actually pretty good too. And then you keep the pings, right? Because the pings are useful at cleaning up more than the 1 1 1 instance. And die here, right? Mining casualties now. Do you think the first shrooms can be their conductivity is more important? Pick two. Oh my, Reptile, that's a very tough one. Another prismatic. I actually don't even know to tell you the truth. hold it so long, my family. I really don't usually hold it so long, but it kept uh, it kept giving me like interesting decisions every turn that I didn't expect. Usually I play it in the 4-4, four, four, 5, five, five to 6-6 six, six range is I think the most common. Yeah, but there are two 1-1s one -ones that summon two 1-1s one -ones that represent 12 damage though, right, Ivanovich? And this will become a 10-10, those will stay 1-1s, one and the Rat Scale Naga will be gone. Mind if I roll need. The victory is yours. I'm gonna wash my hands though. Do you think it's good to start with Loyal Henchmen starting hand and trade away? At least you can enjoy it. I mean, that would be the best, so you guarantee not drawing it, Johnny, yeah, right? But... Well, we are going for 12-0. Final bus. Um... People said I should retire a double blood, huh? Let's go. Let's try and pull off the Bray, huh? Am I coining mining casualties? I think I am. Let them dagger, I don't even care. I'm playing Razor, Petal, OTK, and Twist. <laughs> Damn, dude. Let's go, 12 0 says Gong. Was House and Dog sitting? There you are, Sev. I was mentioning you on Saturday, actually. The battle. They don't replay it. That's interesting. I think DK might be better than the win rate suggests. DK feels kinda mid, but it's a good class. It's a good class. My shining. 
That's gay, right? I don't know. My opponent has played three Kajamites so far. So I, I don't know. Is it Unholy Frenzy here, guys? Will the vision not guide me? I mean, I could well bunker, but Unholy Frenzy is kill a 3 to summon a 4 or 5. As in trade unholy. I think it is. They're being dunked by Hyrule decks. I'm happy to be dunking people with the Holder Raptors combo. 10 1 with a Hunter. Very nice, Ziff. Super nice. That's really nice. Am I playing Swarm Guard now? No, I think I he must see if I find Blood Tap now. No. So do I now take Patchwork over Runes of Darkness? This is interesting. I think I do. I'm gonna stay in control, I think it's gonna be... It's rough though because their hand is full of spells. I think I still do. I think I can one make her. The there is no way though, dude. There is no way though, dude. This is like eight times in a row. And it's the only card which is dead in my deck. <laughs> what? How? Like, can someone explain how though, please? Holy crap. <laughs> if a novice said there's only one card in my pool. So I know their hands mainly spells I go so far, but Patchwork will still be an assassinate plus a destroy from their deck, right? Oh my god, do you remember that one, Mufandi? Um, do you just tempo the sunspot? I think I do, you kill the 3-1. I was gonna hero power swarm guard, but I think I do, and I think I do kill this. I think I can out control them at this point. And I really hope that they just play like blood guard and dagger, for example. Night captain. Rock. And blood guide. Okay. With every strike, we will strike that costs them 10 mana. My 7 mana card is going to destroy it and the minion is just. Oh, and concedes! No. <laughs> Holy moly. I mean, this is a crazy road, but uh, a new Barak in hand is what I destroyed this time. They're gonna hit me with the Azerite Scorpion most likely now, right? I think we ooh re this is this is a rogue. This is way better than the rogue I drafted today. They got another excavate or what? Collapsed, it's pretty good. Get a draw though. Damn, damn, dude, damn though! Those discovers on point, man! Those discovers on point! Holy crap! Just clean, crisp, suave and smooth. Actually very good, man. It's kind of a little scary. We rise to the wall of the sun. I can be there, a 
They only need one more excavate to be honest with you. Oh yeah, there literally was also an Uber. They're short on resources, yeah, but... So am I. And they chewed a lot, really and truly, they just discovered... They used, like, their one excavate, which they discovered from their quad Kajamite as well, right? And I am in a very rough spot. this rust morn would have been good yeah would have actually i'm fine with a double swarm i need my brew my key master something like that uh do i just blood boil here i think i do So that either blood boil hero power or I could swarm guide brew hero power this and hit here. I think I do this though. And then go for the power play next. Then we go four brew four. I don't think Blood Boy is too good there as much as I think it's getting way worse soon. Really good draw for them again. Okay. okay. I'll make sure you suffer. That was a beaut. That was a beaut. And actually the recording might be working with Twitch chat and everything, so uh You could say hi YouTube, I think the chat should work. Thank you for the support, guys. Look at all that insanity. <laughs> I don't even know what the MVP is. Getting a lot of support coming in here. Yeah, no frost even, right? MVP? I mean, honestly, the brew swarm guard combo is great. Henchman always... Henchman always super, super great. Runes amazing. Hema amazing. Just pretty sweet all around there. Thank you for the support, guys. Psych, thank you for the gifted sub. Joao or Joao, thank you for the follow. Joe, thank you for the 30 months prime. Coming in with the best arena streamer goes 12 0. What else is new? Also, hi, YouTube. Yeah, this is, uh, honestly, the deck, I knew the deck was good. I, I didn't expect it to be a 12-0 level deck, though. Um, I think the deck was good, right? I, I knew it was a risk picking Blood Boil early in the draft, but uh, kind of paid off, right? Kind of paid off, I would say. 
Wand maker. Yeah, wand maker was really rough. That's a great one. If you watch this run on YouTube, let me know. Did I actually never roll anything else from one maker apart from that dumb rune forging useless card? Maybe once? Let me know down below what you think. And let me know what you thought the MVP was. And whilst you're there, like the video, sub to the channel. I hope you enjoyed that beautiful 12-0. Been a while since I got a 12-0 death knight. So uh, I'll take that, especially with unexpected no thrust deck.